So like in correlation to something of the last cycle, where we at currently, we are, you know, I, I'd say we're in relative terms at like this level give or take somewhere in here, just like, you know, breaking out, going into something that seems to be a little more parabolic. But one of the main factors to that is if these ETF inflows continue. As of right now, we've, we've seen days of, you know, 400 million net coming to the positive side for Bitcoin and everything is going to track with it, you know. So, you know, we've seen a big day for Ethereum. So Ethereum is having its largest candle. And, you know, and I haven't moved any of this stuff since the last time that we, we talked about Ethereum. Where, hold up, let me uh, do that. So last time we talked about Ethereum is talking about how we are in this wedge and we're breaking out so this whole month has been a huge breakout candle and similar to like this last cycle here there was a big breakout candle and typically that's a, the the exciting part of where we start to get going and then you make your way towards your all-time high and then you exceed your all-time high to a certain degree